there guys, Coaster Chattel here, Doncaster born, but built for theme parks and welcome to a theme park newsroom update where today we're going to be speaking about Wallaby Roan Alpes and oh my giddy ante, are we excited for this one? This is a, this is concepts, the first concepts of a brand new area called Exotic World. Uh, so this is replacing the Aqualibi Water Park, which has now officially closed its doors for good. Uh, so the water park's getting torn down, this new area is coming in. Um, I believe it's going to be opening in 2022 and then across the years between 2022 and 2025 there'll be multiple million of euros investments into the area including a very exciting project for 2024 which I'll share about in this video so I'm going to sum it all up recap some details in an article and share my thoughts on this new area so before we get started guys, make sure you like, comment, subscribe, click the notification bell so you never miss YouTube video. We're on the road to 3,000 subs and a million views. We're on the way. We're nearly there. So please, 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 let's get it done. Also guys, check the description down below for social media links, uh, the Google Forms link for your own video ideas, uh, form to submit your own video ideas. And also guys, the article link will be in the description down below. And for now guys, let's have a look at exactly what's going on at Wallaby Road Alpes over the next few years. So at the start of this season, they gave details on its future exotic island themed area, three new features scheduled and 15 million euros investment between 2022 and 2025. The Aqualibi Water Park, which will be replaced by this area, has closed its doors for good and the park unveiled two concept arts, which I'm going to share on your screen. You see the first one already, you saw it behind me as well, the first one. <laughs> uh, but I'm now going to share the second image on your screen now. Now, there seems to be some red rails to the left of the image. And Theme Park Magic, a European news source, uh, said on social media, in 2024, for the park for its 45th anniversary will expand with innovation and sensation, presumably a new roller coaster. Uh, now, we don't know exactly uh, what the new coaster will look like. We don't even know if that's the, the, the final colour scheme, because obviously you saw the early concept arts for Wallaby Belgium's uh, mega coaster coaster a few a couple of years back and you know it was red rails and it didn't end up being that so it won't end up being the final call scheme but the fact there's a new coaster in line for this park is amazing and to be fair airtime news the article which i've linked in the description down below they reported about this area and it will be replacing the aqualibi aquatica area or water park which is uh, which will be closed and demolished now Obviously, this part of the park is going to need some uh, some some TLC, and I think the exotic island area will be a fan dabby dozy addition to the area. And as you see by the second concept image, there we go. It, it look, it's already on your screen, by the way. It, the red rails. I mean, this is just going to be a wonderful addition, and I cannot wait for the new coast to be revealed for 2024 as well. Overall. I think this is going to be brilliant. So there we are, ladies and gentlemen, thrill six of all ages. That is talking about Wallaby Rhone Alpes, and between 2022 and 2025, Exotic Island will open. Now, obviously, the big talking point will be the brand new roller coaster for 2024, which is not officially confirmed yet, but from the red rails, it looks very likely to be, and from, from numerous news sources as well, it's presumably going to be a brand new roller coaster for 2024 to celebrate the part's 20, uh, 45th anniversary. Let's say 25th. It's it's 45, 45 years in 2024. And um, you've got to think about this. You know, it was only 2019 when they revealed uh, Mystic, uh, which was their their Ghost Star Infinity Coaster. So it will have been five years since Exotic, uh, sorry, since Mystic opened, uh, when this new coaster opened in 2024. It'll be five years. So presumably it's going to be something great. Now you've got to remember, 15 million euros investments between 2022 and 2025 with three new features. And uh, now you saw the concept arts from the area we know there's going to be an interactive play, water play area we know there's going to be a San Paolo water mania attraction so that's going to be uh, two of the additions two of the features we know there's going to be another feature as well so if you think about let's and, and include all the theming from the area as well 
let's take one or two million euros away from the 15 million euros maximum three million euros so you're looking here at between 12 and 14 million euros for the entire coaster in terms of the coaster itself you're going to look for something that's probably cheap um something that's cheaper than expected now obviously what could they go with well they already have a great relationship with intamin so i'd love to see something like a, a taiga at linden mackey or uh, like intamin's version of helix at leesburg something like that uh, like a, a taran style ride at fantasia land but obviously with the less theming um, they could go down the Vacoma route, they could go down the Suspender Thrill Coaster route, uh, something like uh, Hal's Uber Kopf uh, that opened alongside Voldampf at Tripstrill uh, in Germany. Uh, they could go down, and this is just a bold prediction here, they could go down Europe's first single rail roller coaster route because you've got to think, Railblazer at California's Great America is only a few million dollars. So, um,. I mean, it's reported to be between four or five million dollars. I've heard all these people saying it's around seven million dollars to cost. So if you think about all the theme that you put into it as well, I think there's a real chance they could go down the single rail route, make it a bigger layout, a custom layout, the only custom layout outside of Jersey Devil Coaster at Six Flags Great Adventure, which will open at some point. I think I think it's pretty much open now anyway. Um, or I think it's soft opened or media opened. But I think that Europe's first single rail coaster wouldn't be a bad option to go for, especially if you theme it up nice and well. And I think that, you know, that would be a wonderful route to go down. So there's a million different options right now. Who knows? They could just put more money into the investments and end up going for a B&M invert or something like that. Something ridiculous like that, uh, but probably not. But I think there's a million different ways you could go down at the moment, so we don't know exactly what for sure. Don't forget, this coaster's, well, what's presumably going to be a coaster, is going to open in 2024, so we probably won't hear much about it now in terms of the coaster until probably next year, So or, or, or sort of start of 2023. So stay tuned for the channel for more details on that. Uh, we have officially started the playlist now for the exotic island area, uh, which we've labelled between 2022 and 2025. Uh, so please, please, please go and check out, obviously there's one video on there but check out for more updates and um, we post it onto the playlist but for now guys thank you very very much for watching this make sure you like comment subscribe and for now my name is coach chow keep on the coast live i'll see you guys in the next video very very soon take care guys have a wallaby tastic day or wallaby however you prefer to say it